76 and thou child shall be called the prophet of the highest for thou shalt go before the face of the Lord to prepare his ways for 77 to give the knowledge of salvation to his people by the remission of sins in verse 78 through the tender mercy of our God whereby the day spring from on high a visited us verse 79 to give the light unto them that sit in darkness and also in the shadow of death to guide our feet into the way of peace our calling is to call people to the way of salvation and to bring light to the people understanding to the people so that with the understanding of the way of salvation the word of truth the word of salvation they will know what it means to have the salvation of the lord and what the effect and the impact is of that salvation of the lord why tell everyone because they want everyone saved why preach the gospel of salvation to every creature because he wants everyone to know everyone to have everyone to believe that word of salvation mark 16 15 and he said unto them go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature reach everyone touch everyone enlighten everyone preach to everyone go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature you must do something about it verse 16 he that believes and is baptized shall be saved is the word of salvation gospel of salvation the truth of salvation he that believes and is baptized shall be saved but he that believes not shall be damned before somebody can truly be saved he must repent of sin but must hear that from the preacher the preacher must tell him or her that sin destroys and sin damps the soul and sin will bring eternal judgment and so the only thing to do the right thing to do will be to run away from that sin to repent from the sin and we, have, we find that the uniform testimony of scripture and the uniform proclamation of scripture there must be repentance before salvation without repentance there can be no salvation mark 1 verse 14 now after that john was put in prison jesus came into galilee preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God and saying the time is fulfilled the kingdom of God is at hand look at this repent ye and believe the gospel every individual that hears the word repent ye and then after that you believe the good news everyone that is coming to the knowledge of the sins he has committed, of the sins he has practiced, of the evil he has done. Repent ye, it's personal. Repent ye at this present time. Repent ye and believe the gospel. That's the way of salvation. That's what happens before salvation comes in salvation is available and for you to come into that salvation you must actually flee run get away turn from the rose to come for them to see the salvation of god which he has provided they must bring forth the evidence the product of repentance there must be repentance before anyone will see the salvation of the Lord. 
Luke chapter 24, verse 47. And that repentance and remission of sins should be preached. You see the order there? Repentance first, and then after that, remission of sin. Repentance first, after that, forgiveness of the sins that are repented of. You confess and forsake the sin, and then there will be freedom from sin, there will be salvation. And that repentance and remission of sin should be preached in his name among all nations. It's not peculiar to Israel. It's not peculiar to Jerusalem. Among all nations beginning at Jerusalem. If we don't preach repentance and the people don't know the danger of continuing in sin and they just think that salvation has come is for everyone. Raise up your hand. Accept the salvation now. Accept Jesus. They have their sin. They have Jesus on top. They have their evil. They have Jesus along with the evil. They have their iniquity. They have Jesus along with the iniquity. Mm. Salvation doesn't come that way. Mm. There must be the proclamation. There must be the preaching. There must be the declaration of repentance toward God before the salvation comes in. Let's rise up, let's rise up now and talk to the Lord. Open your mouth and talk to the Lord in prayer. Yes, brethren, there must be the proclamation 